it's part of who we are as a species to ask the question of where are we? Where did we come from? Where are we going? And are we going there alone? The largest mirrors in the world enable a chance for all of us to answer those questions that mean so much to us. My name is Patrick McCarthy, and I'm the principal astronomer behind the Giant Magellan Telescope Project, the largest telescope in the world, handcrafted start to finish here at the University of Arizona. The process of making a mirror, in some sense, it's like making a cake. First thing is you get all the ingredients. We have the glass. You build the mold, and we put the glass on top. And then you put it in the oven. It's then heated up to such a high temperature that the glass melts till it follows into the mold and makes the rough shape of your cake. Now in our case, the icing is the hard part. The mirrors weigh about 17 tons. They're up to 8.4 meters in diameter. That's a really big piece of glass. Then to turn that piece of glass into a final optics takes another two to three years of precision grinding and polishing and testing. Each mirror from start to finish takes roughly seven years to produce and there's roughly a hundred people working on it, so about 200 person years that go into making one of these mirrors. The Giant Magellan Telescope will be sited in the Chilean Andes. They have the sharpest images in Chile, dry weather, clear skies, and no artificial lights. It's a perfect place for astronomy. The challenge, of course, is how do you handle this beautiful precision piece of glass? And so we lift it with suction cups. The mirrors are moved very carefully because they are glass after all. Telescopes are our vehicles of discovery. They're our ships in the universe. And the heart of the telescope is the mirror. It's a thing that collects the light that's come from millions or billions of light years away and brings us that information that can allow us to answer those questions. Where did we come from? Where are we going? Are we alone?